Ow! Son of a... Action! Welcome back to Man's World. This is a segment called Man's World. And it's called Man's World not because we're chauvinistic pigs, but because that is my advanced names together. And if you have anything to say about it, leave it in the comments so I can delete it. Yeah. Bill Tong. Bill Tong. See? Bill Tong. Rotten meat. It's air-dried beef slices. Sorry. From Africa. Southern, South Africa. And this is a Strive brand. Which it makes it, this is what you eat before you go, uh, uh, you know, lift weights or some. This is nothing funky or junky. It's just made with a simple few ingredients. Full of flavor. Strive is good for your snacking. It's got 90 calories, one ounce per serving. There's eight servings per bag because it's an eight ounce bag. And this ran me 10 bucks. $9.99, something like that. You can't hide money, y'all. You can't do it. What does it smell like? Oh, it smells like beef jerky. Yeah, it's just beef jerky. Check us out though. But uh, supposedly they do a lot of different things to it. Not just like, you know, Van's lazy butt over here. Yeah. Beef makes I'm going to pull jerky. one out right here. And I want you to see how thin that is. is it? Oh, I forgot it. Casually. I hope it ain't good because we just lost one. So they just air dry this. They, they take a box. I don't know how this company did it, but they take a box <coughs> and put a light in it. And they hang this up like this. Dude, it looks like leather. And the light bulb Look right at it out. Look. It looks like a piece of leather. Yeah. It don't have any texture like normal beef jerky does. No. This is a shoe. Somebody's cut up a shoe. <laughs> this is a loafer. This is a bean loafer that somebody's cut up and put spices on. So the tongue off of boot. This is a yeah. This is what this is. This is somebody's old work boots, and it's and it's been aged in their foot sweat. I hope this tastes better than that. <laughs> Ooh, it tastes like foot sweat. <laughs> you got your, your puke bucket? Uh, nah, nah I ain't gonna be that bad. I'm just playing. I use my cup. Yeah, right. <laughs> it smells goddamn good. It does. Here, let's get it in there. Cheers. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Okay. It is good. It's got liquid smoke. Definitely smoke flavor. Yeah. Hang on a minute. You ever tried dry beef? Mm hmm That comes in a little jar? Cured beef. That's what it tastes. I mean, that's what the texture kind of like. It's not real salty like that. Well, I mean, it's also tender. It's not like chewy like beef jerky is. That, that's really dang good. It is good. It's different. Bill Tong. B I L T O N G. Hickory season. The band has been calling it Bit Long ever since I got here this morning. Built Long. It's bit. It's, and there's no L in it. It's Bill Tong. Bill Tong, yeah. There's no L in it. There except is for L. that one. <laughs> there's no L in it after the T, is what he means. Strive. I'm glad that I found this at Walmart. I could do This is good. Yeah, this is Strive. What we got on the back there? Oh, it's got. No nitrates, no gluten, no MSGs, nothing artificial. That's a plus. Yep. Uh, 16 grams of protein per serving and no sugar. I like protein. So it's keto. Oh, it really? Ke yeah, it's got to oh. be because there's no sugar. Well, right. I'll be damned. No sugar. Let's see carbs. No carbs. It's for all uh, my keto friends out there. 430 milligrams of sodium, which is pretty cool for beef jerky. I mean, beef jerky is going to kick it up there. I like this. Got Dude. And whenever I come over to Vans, I know I gotta take one extra uh, blood pressure pill because you always gonna have some sodium pill something over here. And I'm I don't know if you wondering if you know if I sit like this, these stools are very uncomfortable. And I'm the one that brought them over here. I got a big I got a big uh I got a big apple bottom like those girls in the rap videos, but I can't twerk, so I'm useless. I've never noticed, I've never noticed the apple bottom. I've never noticed women before. <laughs> Yours, I'm talking about. I never. Oh, we're not doing the broke back mountain thing this time. Listen, I got no problem with those guys. They were just following their carnal nature. Anyway, this is good. I like it. Um, I give it a five really i do i like it i like it a lot um i think that uh packaging and all everything going to it it's not yeah. hot at all it's got a good beef flavor it tastes like regular old beef jerky, like just favorite uh, original beef jerky yeah but it, it tastes it's got a store-bought taste to it you know oh yeah it's yeah it's got yeah. an art i mean it says there's no artificial anything in it but it, it's got one of those flavor me, saver packs i don't know what it, it is man it's got a flavor saver pack in it. But I've never had bit, bit tong. No. Bill, 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 uh. Bill tong. Bill tong. I what never, is wrong with you? I've never had this before. Yeah. A lot, a lot of people's asked me to try it or make it, and I, I've never, never done either one, so. This is a new one on me. I guess I'll give it a five since I've never tried built tongue before. I guess, you know what? I'm going to have to go ahead and leave this open until I try some more or some like homemade stuff. Anybody out of the 12 subscribers that Van has can tell me uh, so that if they know somebody that makes this stuff like just out in their backyard, let us know. We'll gladly pay for it and we'll pay for shipping to get it to us to try. But this is, I mean, it's, I'd like to try it. It's tasty. They have more flavors at Walmart. I don't want to keep giving them advertisement because I'm not getting paid by them, but that's where it came from. Walmart. 
Walmart. But there's more flavors. There was, I can't remember, there was like three flavors by Strive there. I know there's a And there's all built on? Yeah, all built on. I wonder why they, I wonder why they, they decided to use that instead of just beef jerky. It's uh, because they can make it keto? You, can, you know what? If you want to sell something, you got to be different. And that was the only brand of built, built on that was there. That was the only brand. Out of the whole section, you know, Walmart's got the big section now of jerky. And that's the only built on that was there. Kudos to Strive. Yeah. And you can't even spell it right. Strive is with an I, not a Y. I hate like to be the one to point out, uh, you know, the, the obvious. I like it. It doesn't taste like shoe leather. No, it looks like it, though. It's not real dry. To me, it's not. No, it's not. It's got it's got, it's just, it's got mm -hmm. a juiciness to it. You know, and I think the real thin pieces is, like, better anyway. It's, it's like, uh... Show them what the back of them looks like, Matt. You know, all in the bag. See all that down there in the bottom? It's all... You get a lot with this. You get a little shake in the bottom. You know, yeah. what, you know what you could do with that? You could put that on salad like bacon bits, and that would be good. That would be good. Yeah. You put or, that on salad. You're welcome. Put it on a burger. Put it in your eggs when you cook your breakfast in the morning. Put it in a breakfast burrito. Nachos. Ooh, with cheese. Maybe we need to get some out. Maybe we should. Uh, maybe we should make. We, we, just, we make some built 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 on nachos. Give me all some ideas here. Yeah. Go get you some nachos. Yeah. Some tortillas. Yeah. Some eggs. Ooh. Throw something together. A breakfast nachos. Man, this is With awesome. Built on. Yeah, I like it. Now that you've mentioned all that, I'm like, that bag would go a long ways. It's not like ba buying baking bits. No. This bag is full all the way up to right here. It's like no, you know. All the way up to right there, this bag is full. It's like not ladies giving you family sized bags, but still having the same amount of chips mm -hmm. in them as the regular size. Cost you more. It's because it says it on there. You know, it's a half a pound, dude. Really, I just thought about this. Eight ounces, that's a, a half a pound for ten dollars. You can't eat all that in one second. I couldn't make this for ten dollars. No, it couldn't. would cost me more than that in the meat just to make this. I know it. So it is perfect. But anyway, Bill Tong, y'all. Go ahead and get you some yeah. Walmart. I know you got a Walmart somewhere. Walmart is everywhere. They like cockroaches. Go to Walmart, get you some of this stuff and try it because it's worth the ten dollars mm -hmm. that you have to pay for it. It's not something you're gonna eat eat all in one sitting. You're right. You know, it's it's delicious. It's good. There's flavor to it. Uh, there's juiciness to it. Right. Um, even though it looks like boot leather, it does not taste like it. Right. And, uh, you know, so yeah, if you go out and get you some, if somebody's like, hey, man, what are you doing? And you're like, I seen Matt and Van eat this on Man's World. And uh, they said it was real good. And they know everything because they're smart and wise in their old age. Mm -hmm. And I decided to come by. And you can find more of these videos in the playlist right up here. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment in the comment section down below. You have a good one. And you come back. Ah! <laughs> Hit it.